And could Mummy, in his first year as the head coach of the Wildcats, give the Cats their second victory yeah. over this tradition-laden team? be Seth Hansen, the freshman out of Dallas. Ball spotted down at the 20. It's a 30-yard field goal attempt. It is good. Seth Hansen. First and 10, the tie from its own 42. And a big haul for Curtis Alexander, and look at him go. He's gone. All the way for the touchdown, a 58-yard run. spotted out of the 31 yard line it's got the distance it is good Anthony White touchdown to Goss. Goss is going to throw. Downfield, he's got Jackson. That's an Alabama touchdown. 40 yards on the play. He did make one from 48 yards earlier this season. Here's the kick. It's blocked. And it's picked up by Anwar Stewart. Anwar Stewart goes all the way. Welcome back to Commonwealth Stadium. Regulation play is ended with Kentucky and Alabama tied 34-34. The toss of the coin here at the middle of the field. Kentucky wins the toss. Elects to go on defense. Alabama has selected this end of the field to play on. Over the middle, it's caught by Goss. Fumble. Kentucky recovers. Alabama 26. Couch to the air. Touchdown, Kentucky wins. First Kentucky win since 1922 over hey, Alabama. 75 years, baby, it's all over with now. The Kentucky Wildcats have defeated Alabama for only the second time in history in overtime. A 26-yard touchdown pass from Tim Couch to Craig East wins it at OT for Kentucky. That's our final score, Kentucky 40, Alabama 34.